Hello YouTube, Pasher here today, and I will be showing you how to level up your sneak and your pickpocketing in this video. Now, you're going to want to be in a high Hrothgard and learn your first two shouts from the Greybeards. After you learn those shouts, they will send you on a quest. You can either do the quest, not do the quest, it's really up to you. So, after they send you on the quest, they are going to be praying up in these two hallways. So, as you can see, there is only one this time. So all you have to do, it's a very easy process. Go behind him, go into sneak, pull out your daggers, which I haven't equipped. Oh, yes, I do. Pull out your daggers and just attack. Now, if they turn around, not a good sign. So I would not attack them when they turn around. Now as you level up, the less you'll get detected, the faster you can do it. So, I am going to come back to you when I am level 100, and I will tell you exactly how long it took me. So, be right back. And we're back. Okay, so I just got to level 99. Okay, so to get to level 100 in the sneak, it should take you about uh, 9 or 10 hits by the end. That's just what I've been counting. So, uh, so about like, yeah, 9 or 10. So as you see, I just got to level 100, and I leveled my character up uh, 1, 2, 3, 4... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen times while doing that. Uh, so I recommend while you do that, uh, spend some of the perks on um, the knife thing that will come in handy for the pickpocketing. So I will catch you later in Riften for the pickpocketing tutorial. Uh, catch you on the flip side, guys. Okay, and we are back. We are in Riften. Now, one of my tips for you guys is when you're starting off, or even right now if you're pretty far in the game, uh, just buy a carriage from the White Run Stables and just travel to every hold in the game. That'll just make your life a lot easier, but if you do feel like walking, Riften is in the bottom right side of the world map. So once you come in, it doesn't really matter. Uh, just pull out your weapons, hit a guard, and put them away right away. Uh, uh, so they do not attack you. So you're just going to say, yes, uh, I submit, take me to jail. Uh, and they will take you to jail. Once you are in jail, uh, there is a lock pick on top of this plate. And you do start off with that one. But I recommend you pick up that lock and then you save, uh, just so if you do happen to break both of your locks while you do this, uh, you can just keep loading with two locks. Uh, there are guards, so once you get out, you will have to fight them, so let's do this. Okay, so once you do get out... I recommend that you save again because you have to kill the guards and it could be fairly difficult if you do not have like high health or whatever but if you do do what the video I just showed you on the sneak I would recommend putting it on what I did your magic and health this will, it will make this part a lot easier and also the backstabbing a lot easier once you get your daggers back so I'm just gonna throw on my fire real quick and my healing and unrelenting force so let's do this uh... this this part is fairly difficult i'll be honest because you'll lose a lot of your health from that big guy right there he, uh, my tactic is just to let him chase you around and then another guard will eventually show up who is trying to uh, kill you, so I'm just gonna fast forward through this so I can just get to the main point.
Okay, so I killed them. Now all you do is need to sneak up to Sibby Blackbriar and then get hidden. This may start off slow at first because you may not have your lot or uh, pickpocketing skill very high, but after a while it should become fairly easy. So I'm just gonna fast. F I'll just fast forward to when I am 100. Okay, so it's got to level 99, and I thought I'd just show you the end. So what you're gonna do basically is just keep taking the stuff out of his pockets and putting it right back in. Um, this really isn't time uh, saving, I would say, but it's definitely the quickest in the game because it's taken about an hour to get to level 100 compared to the 12 minutes of the sneak, but you know, I would definitely rather want to do this than walk around, pick up pocketing people, and just getting into all the fights, and I feel like this is definitely the best way in the game. If you know another, I would love for you to comment it. Uh, I will make a video, I'll talk to you guys. So, um, yeah, so this whole process for the sneak and the pickpocketing should take about probably an hour, 15, hour, 20 minutes. Definitely better to do it this way than actually doing it. Uh, that's that's my opinion. I know there's a lot of people out there saying uh, power leveling isn't the way to enjoy the game, but I would say for these two and some of the other ones I'll be doing uh, tutorials on, some of them will definitely make sense. Like this one, you don't really, this is kind of a pointless skill to just do on yourself. So I definitely recommend this. I'll just show you again, level 100 pickpocketing and level 100 sneak. So this, uh, this is the video. So please rate, comment, subscribe, and recommend. That would be really nice. Recommend me to your friends, post me on your Facebook or Twitter. That would be awesome. And I will definitely have all of the next videos out by the end of this week. So there should be about 13 videos on my channel, and I will have every single power leveling video for every single skill, so you'll just be able to go on my channel and search the skill. So thanks again, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Have a fantastic Skyrim playing career.